Simon Rusty told me to live my life. And, uh, you know, I'm not thinking about it as much as I used to, and so far, so good. That's great. Oh, I know what I want to talk to you about. I've been having this dream. Right. I've had it like three times. I'm in this room, and uh, there's all these virgins, beautiful virgins, my God. And they all want to have sex with me. Wow. And I count, I keep counting them up, and I can only count 71. One, two, three, four, five, six. I can't think with my head. Seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm tall. Sometimes I'll start off with one, two, three, four. Right, two, the head count. Three, yeah, yeah. Are you expecting more or less? I'm expecting 72. What if you just miscounted? That's a possibility. So, were you tempted to have sex with Well, them? I wanted to, but I was too concerned with the missing 72nd. That was the issue. What's in interesting to me is that I find you're focused on the number of women who apparently are very interested in you, and yet, Larry, you seem preoccupied. I'm just wondering, have you ever noticed the disparity in these two chairs? Your chair is so much better than this one. This is not a comfortable chair at all. Did, did you buy these chairs? Yes, I, I bought both of them. You picked out both I picked of them? I picked them out, yeah. What was going through your head when you picked out this chair? You picked out a great chair for yourself. That's a gorgeous chair. I would have that in my house. But this one, it's not comfortable. I'm constantly shifting from side to side. You have the comfortable chair. You have taken the good chair. It's interesting. You are the first and only patient who has ever said anything negative about that chair. I, I don't find that interesting at all. Well, I do, and that's my job, to find things interesting. Well... Interesting with a chair. I don't know what you're writing over there. Chair it's, issues. It's, uh, <laughs> I think there's something deeper. I, I don't think you're writing anything. I think you're... Well, I could show you. Huh? I could show you. You know, I mean, you're, you're a nice man, but, you know, do you, do you do that much between you and me? Don't you think that I do a significant amount of help to you? Eh. Yeah. Really? May I be honest with you? I hope that you can always be honest with me. Well, I'm often never honest with you, but here's what I'm proposing. I think you should go chair shopping. I think you need another chair. And you know what else? I'm willing to go chair shopping with you. Will you think about it? I don't know, but I do know that the session is over, and so we'll have mm. to pick this up next time. It's tough for you to have to look at that watch, isn't it? It must be a little awkward. You know, I, I see it. You, I know you, you see can't it. I'm not trying to sneak it. You can't, you're trying to do a little sneaky watch peek. I'm not trying to do a sneaky watch peek. I'm trying to be efficient with our time. Why don't you put a clock behind me so you can have a clock, you know, when the time's up. But nevertheless, okay. it is it is over, and uh, I'm I'm looking forward to seeing you again next week. So uh, you got big plans for the weekend? This weekend and all through next week, um, my wife and I go out every single night to a different restaurant because it's truffle season. It's wonderful. Do you like truffles? No, I I loathe them. They're disgusting. Oh. To each his own. To each his own. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, Larry. Okay. And by the way, anytime you want to get rid of me as a patient, just say, uh, I've had enough. It'll be, it'll be, it'll be okay with me. Oh, dear God. I think this is a breakthrough. No, it's not a breakthrough. I think it's a breakthrough. It's not a breakthrough. I'm pretty sure it's a breakthrough. I'm going to write down breakthrough. You're writing down breakthrough. It's just a waste of everybody's time. Break. That whole pad. You might as well throw it. It does nothing, that pad. Breakthrough. Anything else on your mind? You know, 